Present Choirs started last January, in January 2017. It grew out of uh, Serona Meinhardt's White Rock Children's Choir that I sang in as a child um, all throughout my elementary school and high school years. And when Serona and her, her husband decided to move to the Sunshine Coast last January, uh, she asked if I would continue working with her adult women's choir that um, she started five years ago. So I took over this group of, of 30 or so women and um, started rehearsing with them once a week. And we spent from last January to last June together doing our first, our first six month season. Singing in a choir is this really wonderful way of, of connecting with other people, with connecting with other people and sharing the awesome feeling of making music and being a part of a group that's working towards something collectively. Um, it's almost like a team sport where you're all working for, um, you're all working towards this end goal of, of putting on a performance or of, of sharing, sharing something with others, with an audience or with one another. Crescent Youth, Youth Choir started in September, so this is the end of our, of our first season together. And there are about 35 singers, uh, mixed voices, so that means we have, um, we have girls and we have guys with changed voices and we have guys with unchanged voices. So uh, it's, it's a real range of, of ages and of musical backgrounds. We have kids who have grown up singing in children's choir or in their high school or elementary school choirs and have been singing their whole lives. And then we have a few members who are brand new this year and maybe um, love music and love listening to music and like to sing, but have never, have never come together to a choir before to sing with others. Our youngest right now is, is in grade eight and the oldest have just graduated from high school a few years ago. So the women's choir is made up of singers of, of all ages, um, of all backgrounds. We have some singers that, that I grew up singing with in White Rock Children's Choir, so girls who are in their, in their 20s or in their 30s um, who's, who sang as children. And then we have some women who have been singing with, in Serona's adult groups for years and um, just love to make music, but haven't necessarily had a lot of choral experience. So it's a real mix. Um, some of our singers are music teachers who um, have studied music or who, who teach music to kids. Some uh, don't know how to read music and really just learn by ear. So it's a, it's a real variety in the group. Our goal is to have a choir for everyone, a place for everyone to sing. So we have, for next season, for 2018, 2019, we will have our women's choir, which is non-auditioned. That means you don't have to have had previous singing experience. You don't have to know how to read music. You just have to love to sing and love to sing with others. And that's, that's the only requirement. Our season runs from September through June. So it's a 10 month season and we take a break for Christmas holidays and often over spring break as well. We are so fortunate to have absolutely fantastic pianists and that makes such a difference to both the rehearsal pro process and the end product. So Ifen, who plays for our women's choir, is just wonderful and she she follows me as a conductor so well and is such a, a clear and, and beautiful pianist, beautiful piano player. And then we have Andrew who plays with our youth choir who uh, just has this absolutely amazing ability to hear exactly what each of the voice parts needs and to help them out by improvising things that aren't even necessarily on the page. It's, it's the singers that really inspire me. I, love watching the joy on their faces as they're, as they're singing together. And I like seeing them improve and grow as a group and the dedication of them showing up each week and really giving their all to rehearsals and being committed. That's, that's why I'm doing this, is, is for them. Someone should join the choir because it is a wonderful community. It is a place where you will learn about your voice, you will learn how to use your voice, you will develop musical skills and, and artistry and all those wonderful things. But even more than that, 
you should join the choir because it's fun and because you will make friends and because it is such a joyful thing to, to sing and to sing with other people. All of the information for how to join our, our choirs is on crescentchoirs.com. There's also information on fees. We do charge fees to cover the costs of operating, basically. So to pay our pianists and rehearsal space and concert costs and to purchase music. So that's what our fees cover. We really strongly believe that singing is a joyful and a heart-filled thing and something that should be an opportunity for everyone to do. So if finances are a problem, we always find a way to, to accommodate that so that money doesn't get in the way.